What if I told you now you can run any OS on your iOS devices whether it is Windows, Mac OS, Linux or any other. Yes, it's possible by using this newly released app on Apple's App Store and it's called UTMSE. So without any further ado, let's see how we can install any OS on our iOS devices using this application. I'm gonna show you the process by installing Windows XP in this video. Although I will make more videos on UTMSE like how to install Windows 11, Mac OS and Linux. So if you face any issues then you can check its playlist on my channel. All the required links are in description. So firstly install UTMSE app from App Store and then go to UTM website and download the pre-built of OS you want to install. It will save your time because this pre-built contain the minimum requirements and required settings that you must do before second step. After downloading the pre-built, go to this website and download the ISO file of OS you choose. Then go to your files app and extract the pre-built zip file. Then you will get the .utm file. Click on that. It will redirect you in the UTM app and you will get the interface like this. Scroll down. There you will get the CD, DVD or floppy in the blue color. Click on that and then click on browse and select your .iso file and then click on play button in the top right corner. Then follow the installation process on screen. You can use your keyboard and mouse or you can use touch gestures as mouse and by clicking on arrow in the top right corner you will get the keyboard option. You can proceed with it too. Now let's see the installation process. At the welcome screen press enter to set up the Windows XP. Now accept the license agreement by pressing F8. Now click on enter button to proceed with partition of the hard drive. Now format the partition using the NTF file system quick format. Wait for the setup to copy files and automatically restart the computer. Now in this process the OS will start installing in your device. While this installation process it will ask for you to choose the region and language and enter your name and organization. After that it will ask for product key that you will get in the name of .iso file you downloaded from that website. After entering the product key you will have to do some more steps like entering the name and password of your virtual machine and setting the date and time, choosing network settings and uh, selecting work group and then you will have to wait for installation to complete and automatic restart. After this process you can use your favorite OS on your iOS devices and you can perform any action on it like uh, original computer. For example playing games, browsing and if you have installed Mac OS or latest windows then you can use it to sideload apps on your iOS devices by following the steps I have discussed in videos of sideloading in iOS playlist so make sure you check Check it out if you want to install apps on your iOS devices outside the Apple's App Store. And yeah, it also depends on your device specification that which OS is going to work on your device or not. After all this process, close and reopen the UTM app and then click on the OS you installed. Then go to CD, DVD or floppy at the bottom and click on that. Then click on clear to free up the space because we don't need that file now. So that's all for today's video. Hope you found this video helpful and subscribe region of tech for more tech contents like this. I will see you in the next video. Till then bye and stay safe.